All right, what's up, Facebook, YouTube? How you guys doing? Um, first thing is first. I like to thank everybody on Facebook. 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 I just fucked that one up. I'd like to thank everybody on Facebook for giving the co advice of what to do about these animals that keep coming in front of my door spraying. I got these wild cats. It's like about three, maybe four wild cats. They come in front of my house and they spray the shit out of the freaking thing. Now, I know a lot of people has been giving us good advice about what to use, spray and this and that. It's really hard to use the right stuff because we have four cats also that likes to go out. And they're the reason why these wild animals are in our area. So, the only thing that I can come up with is by letting the whole Cold Spring Circle, my neighborhood, know what I'm about to do. That way, somebody's gonna let somebody know that Angel's about to catch a cat, it's gonna let them go somewhere real far. So you better get your animal. You better get your cat. If that's your cat, I hope Cold Spring Circle is looking at this video. Nagatuck. If those are your cats that's coming out of your house, coming into my spot, I'm gonna take them, I'm gonna drop them off somewhere else. I got people also on my side telling me what I should do as far as putting antifreeze. I don't wanna put antifreeze because I'm not an animal killer. I don't wanna do that. Now, I know some people's probably gonna think, oh, that's not right. You're gonna catch these animals. You're gonna drop them off somewhere in the woods where they're gonna get killed. That's not my problem. My problem right now that I have is that these animals are spraying in front of my door and it stinks like hell. Now, if no one is gonna do anything about it, as far as the Cold Spring Circle where I live at, and they're not gonna do anything about it, then I'm basically gonna trap these animals in a cage and just bring them somewhere, drop them off. And then somebody else had mentioned, if you catch these wild animals, you could bring them to the uh, animal shelter and they can take them. So I might look into that too. I might call the animal shelter and find out from them if, if I catch these wild animals, could I bring them to them? That way they can fix them, clean them up, and then give them to a homeowner so they won't be any wild animals anymore. They'll be regular, normal cats. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna go that route. I'm gonna find out some information from the animal shelter and let them know what I'm about to do. And then hopefully they can give me some good advice and say, well, if you catch these animals, bring them here, we'll take them and we'll clean them up, we'll fix them and we'll give them to somebody that really wants an animal. Because I'm not trying to kill the cats. Now, I appreciate that everybody's giving Nicole good advice about what to do as far as spray and this and that and all types of stuff, but it's gonna affect our cats too. So, I didn't think about that. You know, I didn't think about that. It's going to affect our cats because our cats, we got four cats. They go outside, they play, they come inside, go to sleep on the couch, so on and so forth. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go with plan B. I'm going to call the animal shelter and let them know what I'm about to do. I'm going to find a cage on eBay. It's one of those special cage that catches wild animals. You know, I'm going to put like some type of meat in there. When they go in there, they're gonna kick the thing by accident. The cage is gonna drop the door, and they're gonna be trapped in there. So it's not gonna hurt the animals. It's just gonna trap them, and then I can figure out what I'm gonna do from there. Like I said, I'm not gonna try to kill these animals or hurt these animals in any way, because I love these animals. I just don't like the fact that they spray in front of my fucking property. That's all. But I just wanted to say thank you, Facebook, for giving Nicole advice. And that's what I'm going to do. Peace.